How's everybody doing with their trading today? This is Monday, 25th of June, 2018. I haven't made a video for a while, but I saw something today that I thought was pretty spectacular. It was a classic trade setup, and if you see something like this, it will help you to make income. What happened today, we're looking at gold here, and right now, you know, in the evening, it's really hard to trade uh, ever since about 6 o'clock you know, you got green and red and red and green, red, green. <laughs> like it's just going sideways. So it's really hard to trade there. And I know we had our signals, which we're supposed to take an entry up here at uh, 1270 and it's supposed to go up. Well, that didn't work out. And most of the signals today haven't been very helpful. <coughs> Sometimes the signals can be helpful, but otherwise, you know, you've got to look for your trade setups with what you know. And you've got to watch the price and see what's happening. You know, uh, what are the candles doing? Who's in control? Uh, buyers or sellers? And I looked at this this morning, and obviously from very early this morning, sellers were selling gold like crazy. I mean, it, this is unusual for gold to go down like it did this morning. And I kept watching that and kept watching it. And then, uh, you know, just about 1 p.m. before the European market opened, I switched over to the 15-minute chart. And if you look at 1 p.m. at the 15-minute chart, this, this dark line here is exactly 1 p.m. I'll move that. You see you have a classic dragonfly doji, and I posted this in the line group. A dragonfly doji is usually a very strong indication of a reversal that's going to take place. And this happened right at support. Man, that was a perfect, perfect indicator of a change in sentiment, a change in the trend. And the next candle on the 15-minute chart, it didn't happen yet. They were still indecisive, but then it started to take off. And by 2 o'clock when the London market opened, boy, they just pushed that way, way up. So according to the T-line strategy, which I teach, using the yellow line, the 8 EMA, after the candle breaks above the 8 EMA, after we've seen a doji, then that's time to take the trade. So you could have taken the trade right there, and that would have given you from, if you took it when that candle closed, right there, and rode it up for about 40 pips on gold. And that was just, just a classic trade setup. You, you know, you've got to watch the candles and, and, and look for something like that, completely outside of the signals. But this is what I've been teaching, is how to watch and read the candles. What is the price doing? right now at the moment and when you see a dragonfly doji right at support and then followed up by uh, a good bullish candle and then it starts to break above the t-line well that's a very strong indication that there's been a change in sentiment a change in the trend and it's a good opportunity to make some income and you don't need to be watching a dozen different uh, currency pairs but just you know, go down to the smaller time frame on whatever you're watching, and if you see that trade set up, then, then be patient and get your confirmation. You look down, you see the stochastic has also started moving up. You've got that confirmation with the candle closing above the T-line, and take the trade. Start with a .01 lot size, that's fine, and then as soon as you get a bearish candle, the next bearish candle, you can add another .01, .02, uh, 0.03, whatever you feel like, as you know, the trend is continuing, you can add to the winning trade. Okay, so I hope this helps you. You know, sometimes the signals don't work out like we, we hope they would. On Monday, it's usually very difficult. A lot of professional traders won't trade on Monday because it's the currency pairs are getting their trend set for the week. And sometimes it just, uh, the market doesn't do what we hope it will do or expect it to do. But when you, you know, watch the candle, see what the price action is doing, and uh, you can take opportunities when they present themselves. And this one was one that was really, you know, just an ideal, perfect trade setup. And so I had a good, good profit on gold uh, earlier this afternoon. Okay, I hope that helps, and I'll see you tomorrow with the signals. Thanks for watching. Take care. Have a great evening. Take care. Bye-bye.